And Kogi state government has raised the alarm over what it described as a desperate attempt by criminal masquerading as politicians to tarnish the image of the immediate past governor of Kogi state, Yahaya Bello, for selfish reasons through the Economic and Financial Crimes Commission. The state government said in its desperation the EFCC has in an amended charge accused the former governor of diverting Kogi state government funds in September 2015 four months before he assumed the position of a governor. It said this was not only laughable, but portrayed the EFCC as an agency infested with persons whose intents disagree with the noble intention of Mr. President to defeat corruption in Nigeria. Commissioner for Information in Kogi State, Kingsley Fowler, said the fact that the EFCC in a charge currently pending before the Federal High Court of Buja further amended the amended charge to include in the count the name Yahaya Bello, describing him as being at large, is ridiculous and laughable. The state government warned political actors to stay clear of Kogi State affairs and desist from their campaign of calumny as the state government has not said its money is missing and has been adjured both locally and internationally as top in the area of transparency and accountability. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.